Welcome to the Folktale Project. This is Dan Shells. Today we're going to start three new tales from Africa. And the first of those tales is going to come from House of Folklore, which is a gathering of tales. And we've read from them before. They're fun. Uh, They're a little... You really have to pay attention. This story is... The story about a beautiful maiden and how the heart of beast got the marks under its eyes like teardrops. This is a story about an alliance. A story, a story. Let it go, let it come. A chief begat a beautiful daughter. She had no equal in the town. And he said... He who hoes on the day the people come together and whose area hoed surpasses everyone else's, he marries the chief's daughter. So on the day the chief calls his neighbors to hoe, let them come and hoe for him. But he who hoes and surpasses everyone else, to him a wife. Now, of a truth, The chameleon had heard about this for a long time past, and he came along. He was eating hoeing medicine. Now, when the day of the hoeing came around, the chameleon was at home. He did not come out until those who were hoeing were at work and were far away. Then the chameleon came. When he struck one blow on the ground with the hoe, then he climbed on the hoe and sat down, and the hoe started to hoe, and fairly flew until it had done as much as the other hoers. It passed them and reached the boundary of the furrow. The chameleon got off, sat down, and rested, and later on the other hoers got to where he was. Then the chief would not consent, but now said he who ran and passed everyone, he should marry his daughter. Then the hartebeest said he surpassed everyone in rowing, so they had a race. But the chameleon turned into a needle. He leaped and stuck fast to the tail of the hartebeest, and the hartebeest ran until he passed everyone, until he came to the entrance of the house of the chief, and he passed it. Then the chameleon let go of the hartebeest's tail. Of a truth, the chameleon had seen the maiden. So he embraced her. And when the hartebeest came along, he met the chameleon embracing the girl. Thereupon the hartebeest began to shed tears, and that was the origin of what you see, like tears in a hartebeest's eyes. From that day on he has wept and not dried his tears. Off with the rat's head. And that is the story about a beautiful maiden and how the heart of beast got the marks under its eyes like teardrops. A story that really delivers on its title, for sure. It's interesting to see how the chameleon is often depicted as this kind of uh, cheat, if you will. And I don't know that it's necessarily fair, but it definitely leads to a good story. This is Dan Scholes for the Folktale Project. Don't forget that you can subscribe to the podcast on Apple Podcasts, Stitcher, Google Play, Overcast, anywhere you like to get your podcasts. You can follow us on Twitter at Folktale Project. You can find us on Auto Radio, TuneIn Radio, iHeart Radio, Spotify, anywhere you like to listen. And you can always head over to folktaleproject.com where you'll find a new story waiting for you every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. As always, thank you so much for listening.